Web accessibility is the ability for everyone, including those with disabilities, to access information and resources on the web. The standards are set by the Americans with Disabilities Act of 1990 and Section 508 of the Rehabilitation Act of 1973. Disabilities may include visual, auditory, physical, speech, cognitive, language, and learning barriers. Many individuals with disabilities report having more barriers online than in their daily life, which shows the need for web accessibility. The Web Content Accessibility Guidelines have organized their framework for web accessibility into four categories for a poor website, perceivable, operable, understandable, and robust. For a website to be perceivable, users must be able to perceive, see or hear the site and resources. The text font should be readable without use of all caps, misuse of bold text or italics. High color contrast should be used with fonts, the background, and the foreground. Videos should be captioned and transcripts should be provided. And adding a visible narrator to an audio file helps some users' perception. For a website to be operable, all individuals must be able to access it, whether they use a computer, phone, smart TV, or tablet. The website must be operable using keyboard navigation, without keyboard navigation being the only option, as some diff users have difficulty with fine motor skills. Documents provided on the website need to be accessible, and all links should be descriptive text, rather than the phrase, click here. HTML and CSS knowledge are essential while building the website, while Flash websites are difficult and costly to make accessible. JavaScript and jQuery can be added for interactivity. For a website to be understandable, users need to be able to understand and comprehend the navigation features and text. Users should easily understand how to navigate from one section of the website to the next. Text information should be chunked or use bullets, and the writing should be free from unknown vocabulary and abbreviations. For a website to be robust, it must have a higher degree of accessibility and compatibility with assistive devices. Building responsive websites for use on mobile devices has increased the robustness of many websites. If a content management system is used for educational purposes, the degree of accessibility or compatibility with devices should be considered. There are numerous resources available to aid website accessibility. The Web Accessibility Initiative, Accessible Rich Internet Application Suite, can provide a framework in accommodating assistive technology. The Worldwide Consortium provides an easy-to-use checklist organizing the checkpoints by three priority levels. Priority Level 1 features must be utilized, while Priority 2 and 3 features should be utilized. WAVE, a web accessibility evaluation tool, is a free website providing immediate error and alert information about accessibility barriers. With regards to document accessibility resources, Microsoft and Adobe both provide accessibility check features in their programs. With all the resources available, inaccessible websites should be history. However, recent studies show that out of 150 middle schools, all had alerts of violations and 54% had errors that require immediate attention. Given the institution's priority to reach all their students, it was expected that this focus be applied to their website as well. Lawsuits are sometimes brought up in response to barriers of web accessibility. However, it is not conclusive that lawsuits result in accessibility improvements. In fact, the same number of control websites studied changed their accessibility as the ones involved in lawsuits. Website accessibility continues to be an important goal for government and educational institutions, as well as private companies. It needs to be a priority to use the resources provided to reduce barriers and improve compatibility with assistive devices. Further research with larger sample sizes, in-depth case studies, and varying age groups will continue to provide valuable guidelines to enhance our ever-changing technologies.